sponsored by Winwing Technologies. They couldn't offer the full cockpit, but we think this is the next best thing. Hello Valued viewers, I hope you're all doing very well. Today is going to be a super exciting one, so get excited. Now back in 20, wow, May 2021 and June 2021, that is like nearly a year ago, we did these videos. Can a World War II battleship superfleet beat a modern US carrier group? And it was fun and it was a good watch, but it's also massively cringeworthy because we just didn't know how to make these battles back then. We didn't know how to make the ship damage models work. So it was fun, but riddled with bugs. But we're a little bit cleverer now. We now know how to make the damage models of the ships work. So we are revisiting it due to popular Demand. I should say at this point, all credit to Hawkeye and his band of excellent cronies who uh, make these battleships. So today, we've kind of done the US carrier group to death. So we're going to do a 1990s Russian carrier strike group versus a back in time World War II mega battleship group. Here's the situation. Let's just say that Russia was, I don't know, attacking some country, generic country, and we invented a time machine used to go and get a bunch of World War II battleships of all coalitions, bring them back to fight the Russians. What would that look like? The two fleets are 80 miles apart from each other. The constitution of the Russian carrier group is thus, at the center of their fleet, they have a Kuznetsov carrier. On that, it has 24 1990s Su-33 naval flankers. Each one is carrying a bunch of bombs and a bunch of big rockets for killing ships. Each of those 24 are going to take off and they're going to fly south and attack the World War II battleships. 20 of them are AI set to a skill level and four of them are humans. Say hello Sock, Grump, Simba and Scott. Hello Grump. Hello, hello Sock, hello, Simba. Simba. And Cat. I have to work with this every day. As well we have at the bow, by three miles, a Kirov battle cruiser, that beast there. We also have two Slava class cruisers, port bow and starboard bow. We also have an anti submarine frigate there, anti submarine frigate there. We also have an AWACS there at 26,000 feet. Tactics the Russians are going to send a picket line forward of the Slava cruisers, Kirov cruiser, and one anti submarine frigate. They're going to launch all of their supersonic anti-ship missiles, obviously, at the battleships as soon as they can. The other ships, well, the interesting thing now is we can actually control the ships in real time, so we don't have to kind of preset them. But what I've got is the carrier and the its escort frigate here, just moving slowly forwards, and then if it's in danger, I can make it run away or flank or do whatever I need to do. That, sir, is the Russians. Now, the battleships. Now, first of all, formation. I asked the boys what formation would a back-in-time mixed coalition battle group actually have, and no one seems to know. So, at the moment, we're just going in a big straight line and hoping for the best. I should say, I fixed. we fixed all of these, and they're all now working, they're taking their hits, and everything should work finally. It's only taken literally a year. We've got Admiral Hipper. We've got Admiral Scheer. Next, Blucher. We've got Scharnhorst, one of my favourite fast battleship. Beautiful. Next, we've got Prince Eugen, as you can see there. I should say, not all of these are battleships. Some are heavy cruisers, some are battle cruisers, but they're all big capital ships at the end of the day. Uh, right, next, the Italians. Roma. Mm, Duca degli Abruzzi. Montecuccoli. Next is French. I could only get one French working properly, and that is the Dunkirk. Wow, four turret, uh, four guns at the front. I didn't know any battleship ever had that. Huh. Nope. Huh. None at the rear. How about that? Pew, maximum pew None pew. At the rear. That's tactical miscalculate. I wonder if that was a. Uh, they did that for restriction reasons. I bet they did. I bet there's a pocket battleship or something. How interesting. Never even seen that ship. Next, the Americans. We finally got the American Iowa class working. Woo! Of the four that were built, we can get three of them working. We've got Missouri, New Jersey, and Wisconsin. And uh, if you want us to just do some other reenactments with these, we can. Now we've finally got them working. Uh, they all pretty much the same, more or less. Um, there you go. That's what they're... Oh, sweet. Nice action of the rear gun turret there. Real big beasts they are. It's nice to have them working finally. Next, we've got HMS Hood, massive uh, British battlecruiser, of course, sunk by the Bismarck. 
one shell in the wrong place. The model's pretty crap, to be honest. But you know, it seems to work now, and that's near enough for me. And we finally got the uh, Japanese uh, Yamato class, the Yamato. Biggest, nastiest one here, 72,000 tons, 18.1 inch guns. That is the one you really do not want to mess with. Those battleships are AI controlled. All they're going to do is charge north and try and kill stuff. And it's as simple as that. I have absolutely no idea how this is going to go. Predictions, guys. Uh, any ideas? I think I think the Su-33s aren't going to be able to carry enough firepower or ordnance to take on all these ships. Depends on what they're throwing at them, because if you put Fab 250s on there, there's stations on the Su-33s that can carry up to six Fab 250s on one station. There's two of them that can carry six. There's two of them that can carry four. And then there's another extra two that can carry three. So, I mean, if you really want to load that up, but at the same time, that's not gonna, I don't think that's going to take off from the carrier. Well, then again, I don't know if, I don't know if burning damage takes effect. I, uh, uh, so what I'll tell you is um, I, we've set the damage models up, guys. So they're, I mean, we can't do it so they're realistic. It's impossible. No one really knows how to make a really realistic model. But I've set them up so that they are very killable. So let's say you dropped a 2,000 pound bomb on one of these. It would take about half of its health down as it probably would in real life. A 2,000 bomb would either sink it or it would very much damage it. So that's kind of how tough they are. They're about as tough as an aircraft carrier in terms of the amount of bombs you can drop on them. So treat them like aircraft carriers. I think the anti-ship missiles from the Russian naval fleet are going to... Well, that's a major thing. Everybody. That's a major thing. Those are massive supersonic missiles, and they're designed for one hit, one kill of pretty much any ship. Uh, it'll break the back of a ship. They've got like a ton warhead on them. It will just smash, including a battleship. It'll penetrate them, and it will kill the battleship. Well, we don't know. We haven't tried it, but... Theoretically, with the damage model set, it should kill a battleship. So we'll see how. And they can't really defend themselves. They can put, they can spray all their guns at them, but they're probably not going to shoot down supersonic missiles, right? Right. Well, at the end of that, we have no idea what's going to happen by the sounds of it. So I guess we're going to try. Stand by. Right, Scott. Can you please unpause the server? Here we go. Get yourself fired up because we've now got the 1990s Russian carrier group recreation against a really weird but kind of cool World War II mixed coalition fully working battleship battle cruiser. Look at that. Look at that. The view on it, guys, is absolutely beautiful. Look at the size of, not Masashi, what's the name? Yamato. We've got Hood. We've got uh, the Iowa class, which are looking sexy. Well, the French first missiles are out. Italians, Germans, Roger. Right, let's go and have a look. <laughs> I can yes, imagine they seeing come. this line of ships coming up, and you're just outside your back porch, sipping your coffee. You can just turn around, walk back inside, like. You know. In case you're new to the concept of a 1990s Soviet slash Russian carrier strike group, you have these things called Mos uh, sorry called Slava cruisers, and you have these things called Kirov Battle Cruisers. They're designed to destroy, I guess, American carrier groups. So they have these massive supersonic shipwrecked, well, I'll show you in a minute, massive supersonic uh, low altitude missiles with massive warheads on them designed to smash through American defenses. And they ripple them all off at once, but the smoke is still out there. Let's go and have a look at one of them. This is one type, it's called a sandbox, traveling about Mark 1.4. The idea is just huge kinematics will smash through the enemy defences, even if the enemy defences were kind of 90s um, SM2s or whatever. Oh, right, Sukhoi's up. Right, the AI going up. Let's go and have a look at them. Now, the funny thing is, even this carrier is, is technically a battle cruiser in its designation, and it has shipwreck missiles. It fires from those ports there. So but this is actually an anti-ship ship. It just happens to carry, there we go, there's an example. Happens to carry lots of aeroplanes as well. It's a lot here. Look at that. Amazing. How much would you love to see that in real life? One problem about this is that the planes launch very slowly, uh, one by one on one ramp. No idea why. Because they should use all of the pads ready, shouldn't they? It depends on how heavy the loadout is. Yeah, good point. That's probably because of the heavy loadout, yeah. Okay, they are getting pretty close, actually. Missile going out from the carrier right as the Su-33 was passed. <laughs> One of those days we're going to get a strike. Look at that coalition, guys. America, Japan, France, Italy, Germany, Greeks Marine, all fighting as one. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if we just don't even get a chance to take off. 
Uh, yeah, that's a possibility, guys. That is a possibility. Right, I'm just in the bunch of uh, sandboxes and shipwrecks here. Let's see what happens, I guess. Oh, the World War II guys even going to fire back? I don't know. Look how much oil they're burning. It's so, the smoke stacks are massive. Rounds going out. Here we go. Are they firing? Yeah, they're shooting at them. Okay, they're shooting at the missiles. I doubt they're going to hit any, but... No. Yes, there. Wow, look at that! Look at all the explosions from the kind of five inch, four inch guns. Ooh, first one's down. Wow. Okay. That's interesting. Ship's hit. A ship's been hit. Ow. Oh, not my beautiful. Oh, no. They hit my beautiful Japanese battleship. Oh, okay, they're all getting hit now. This is big. Wow, look at oh, that. Oh, there goes the Missouri. No. No, they're on fire. One of the Americans is on fire. She's falling out of line. Oh, yeah, there's Canton lag. drop the cheese. Yamato's been hit in midships. Wowee. First volley of missiles. Well, let's see the damage. Oh, there's a whole nother volley coming. Look at the damage. I'm mainly focused on the Americans and the French and the Italians. The Germans have got a Scott 3. Well, until now. Oh, this is going to be ugly. They knew where the threats were. All right, it looks like you guys might not even be taking off, I'm afraid to say. There's a problem with these massive missiles. They're just so powerful. Ship's falling out of line. Oh, one's sinking. One of the Americans is sinking. I salute you, sir. But Jersey you just got hit. Oh, God. You are fighting massive, massive supersonic missiles with huge warheads. Yamato's on fire. God dang it. I really wanted to see Yamato destroying with their 18 inch guns. There's not much we can do about it though, Value Humans. Look, they're all on fire. Ah. The disappointment is palpable, Value Humans. Oh, still volleys going out the German. The Germans are still alive. And so is the English, actually. Hood's still up. Oh, look. There's one German down. One German down. Oh, look, it's all. Look at his face. It's all smashed up. I spot a sub. Oh, wait. That's a sinking mm. battleship. Yeah. Oh, that's a French one, too. One of the Italians is still uh, streaming on. Imagine that. Wow. I'm just sitting watching. Oh, one of the Germans at the very port end is smashed and rusted. All of his superstructures smashed. Okay, well, they're pushing on. Yep, the Japanese are going down. Yeah, Lots okay, of sunk least. battleships, guys. Look at that. That's four ships that are blub blub. That is kind of sad, it's sad but it's also satisfying to watch. God, that's like 10,000 men dead or more. Most of the volleys are gone, but there are still uh, shipwrecks going in at sea. Aha, they're going for dead ships. I'm secretly happy about that. But why did the Russians go after the Americans first? Well, they just did. They know, they they know where the threats they, are at. There you go, you see? They pumped. Oh, they got one. Roma's air defenses are pretty stout. They are, aren't they? The first, uh, the first um, SU-33s are coming in now, guys. Yes, it's going for another um, dead ship. I am happy with that, guys. Right, so far, and distance between them now, because they, they wouldn't have covered much distance. Now 58 nautical between them. Yeah. I don't think they're going That's for bombing a... either. Yeah, yeah, my toes out. Yeah. It's uh, about to overfly at 11,000 feet. Whoa, he's, he's getting absolutely pasted. Boom, 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 boom. Got speed, comrade. This is apparently how Russians do anti-ship. This is going to be interesting, isn't it? Yes, down he goes, guys. Oh, there he goes. I told there you. We've got everything fixed. If bombs miss, I use face. Yep, pretty much. Da, for the motherland. Here, car but I'm steel face. Yep, bombs out. away. The Russian general forgot to tell him that he didn't remove the safety pins, so he had to use his face. Oh, directly at the jet guys! Wow, did you see that? Did you see it just crumple? That absolutely yeah. smegs that battleship. What is it? Oh, it's killed it. It's killed it. That was the Admiral Hipper. Wowee. Oh, I want to say that you guys are going to get a go. See if you can spawn in. You might be able to nab a slot. Stupid Russian carrier groups are too powerful, man. Oh. 
Nope. It's late the league. We probably would have got more of a game if we would have done a uh, US drive through, but what are you going to do? We don't know how it goes until you try. Our flight's delayed. No, uh, you did it. Yeah, but it's not going to happen. Right. You, sir, are dead. I don't even know what that is. That's another Iowa. Ah, oh, a big explosion on another Iowa. No, not the British! Anything but the British! Oh, Hood's about to take a ton of... They went through her! Yes? Okay, it looks like we didn't sort all the bugs out. <laughs> I thought I did, well, guys. I thought yes. I did. She's, she's taken damage before, so... Has she taken damage? Yes, yeah, she has taken damage. Oh, Roma! Roma oh, battleship oh. just took a ton warhead. And she's bleeding. Oh, not Hood again! Anything but Hood again! No, Hood snail can work. Oh! It's happening all over again, guys! Wow, our front turrets have gone mental, look! Look at our front turret! Simba's airborne. Simba's airborne. Go, Simba! Wowee! Hood's down. Yamato's down. New Joyce's down. Admiral Hipper's down. Ah, these guys are so cheaty. Oh, the last the last of the anti-ship missiles are coming out. The last of the shipwrecks are coming out. I'll be able to get airborne and then it'll be game over. Pretty much, boys. It's Russian carrier group, I'm afraid. Leave my battle cruiser alone! Hood's destroyed. Yeah, hood's out. Yes, we shot one down. But enough bullets in the area, Summit's gonna die. Okay, three anti-ship missiles left, guys. Three anti-ship missiles left, and it's all you lot. Yeah, I think I spawn again. Uh, wow, Let's we're shooting, shooting the missiles. It looks like you are going to get a game, guys. They are shooting the missiles down now. Uh, tally hood. Tally hood sinking. We have three that haven't been hit yet, and looks like, uh, yeah, Roma and Wisconsin are still going. Right, it's all plane warfare now. Plane versus ship. Somehow, Admiral Hipper is still just, you know, barely squeaking yep, along. Tally, he's on fire. She's on fire. Tra traffic jam at the Kuzmin off. I knew that was going to happen. You'll have to gun him or something and respawn. No, it's the it's the carrier itself. It won't let them take off. It's ramp. One of its ramps is bugged. What damn it! How hard is it? Oh, it's a chip code. It's always pro always problematic nowadays. Yeah, it spawned me on Cat One. Oh God, Missouri just took or whatever, just took a smash. And these are big bombs. They're dropping like two thousand pounds of bombs on Wisconsin midships. Grumps airborne. God damn it, he is not happy. Well done, Grumptastic. Plenty of battleships to take the Germans, the Italians, and one of the Yanks is still going, guys. Oh, here comes Simba. It's the first human in. Ich bin Simba. I would use the rockets first of all if I were you. Each one of those rockets has a 500-pound warhead on it. That's a big, big warhead. Oh, we've just lost another, lost another ship, guys. It is a unknown vessel. Sorry, Jesus, I thought your name was going to come up more often, but uh, we haven't killed anything yet. Okay, wow, only a quarter of an hour in. Sit rep. Uh, Yamato is smegged. She can't even move. Hippa, smegged. It, I mean, look at it, it's all rust. A midship's destroyed, front turrets are destroyed. Everything's destroyed, apart from uh, Z and Y turrets, or whatever they're called. Uh, Sheer, Blucher, and Sean Horse. Yay! Sean Horse is alive and in good condition. You've still got a fight in your hands, boys. Uh, Roma, which was sunk by. Was Roma sunk by Midget Submarine? I've forgotten. Or was she bombed by the RAF? Dang, I can't remember. Completely she was forgotten. bombed by Midgets. It was Midgets, was it? I know. Oh, I get confused. I know Turpitz was Midget. She's got a big hole in her. A big hole in her. Look, that's where a. Uh, that's where one of those missiles went through. And Wisconsin, that's an Iowa class, in pretty good nick. Go Simba Wimba. Well, let me spawn in, damn it. You just gotta keep trying. Yeah, go just back go to back to uh, spectator and then re, re slot. Go Grumptastic. 
That's actually Grubnik. Oh, sorry. Uh, Grubnik, pig Russian 1990. Okay, Simba, here goes Simba. Go, brave Simba. We believe in thou. Which one are you going for, Simba Wimba? I'm gonna go for. If it, from my right, it'll be the fourth boat. Hold up. That is. Uh, 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 that is. Sh oh, it's my favorite. That's Sean Horst. I hope he shoots you down. Shoot him down, Sean Horst. Socks up. One rocket out from Simba Wimba. And it is a. Miss! Ha ha ha! Sean Horst survives all, Simba! Sean Horst survives all! No! No, my beautiful ship! Ah! She's hurt and she's damaged, but she will survive. Scott's trying to get airborne. They are pinging Simba big time. You're gonna get blown up, Simba. And that is a you problem, I'm afraid. It's a uh, Okay, AI is coming in. Die, AI! I hate you so much, AI! I hate you, I hate you, I Oh, come on, he's going for goddamn... Going for my guy as well. Die, die, die! Oh, they got him! They hit him! They hit him! Yes! AI die! Ah, oh, no! Turn, man! Turn! Evade! Ah, oh, direct hit! But we got him! We got him, boys and girls! Eat some! And he's gonna face a miserable time in that German power camp. Right, how's my boys doing? Simba is alive! Simba, you did a lot of damage! I'm not happy with you! The Rupnik running in! Okay, Simba's taking all the flak currently. Okay, there's a whole bunch of yous. Oh, and Socks up and coming in. Hey, Grumnik, which one are you going for? Grumnik will finish up the uh, last one. Excellent choice, sir. Admiral Shear, I think that was. The uh, Hipper. Hmm. That's what I said, Hipper. Just that Simba in front of you. Okay, the target in Grumtastic. Shoot him down, my beauties! Shoot him down! I don't know why you're not using your rockets, first of all, but that's a Grump choice. Personally, I think Grump would be mad. Grump make picker. Big old bombs, they're Fab 500s, which are 1,000 pound... They're 1,000 pound bombs, equivalent of a NATO Mark 83, which would smash a ship to pieces. Miss! 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 I've decided I'm on the uh, battleship side now. Yes! Scrub missed! Not enough lead, my friend! Not enough lead! Ha 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 ha! airborne. Well, I have no electronics, but I'm still flying home. Ooh, Simba got a bit of a battering. Let's have a look at you. Ooh, you really did, Simba! Look at that! You really did get battering. Well, that's what happens when you damage my beautiful Sean Horst. Okay, I'm coming after the Roma. Okay, got a man on Roma. Got an AI on Roma as well. Everyone's going for Roma. That's okay, Rough I don't mind. Re-attacking. I'm worried about Roma's AA. So you should be. So you should be. Look at Grump hunting the weakest gazelle. Big pickle. Is he gonna hit? Is he gonna hit? Is he gonna hit? Big pickle. Yes! It missed by about two feet! I'll take it, Grump. I will take it. That's unfortunate for you, sir. Don't get shot, whatever happens, Grump. Ruin that beautiful Grump face of yours. It, it's an annoying flight when you don't know where that horn silencer is. Oh! Massive 500 pound rockets. That's him dead. It's gotta be him dead, right? Grumpnik, uh, yeah, yeah, he's dead. Check, hipper. Dang it, my beautiful hipper. All right, sock. Time for you to face my beautiful, beautiful battleships. 
Oh, that was premature. I would say that was premature, but let's see. Come on, Roma, dodge that. them. Yeah, well, I know he's used to that. That's what Mrs. Damp says. Here I go. No, you got a direct hit on the stern. How could you, Damp? Pew, 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 pew. God damn it. Oh, hit. Oh, you've almost finished it. Rome is almost dead. Ooh, shock. Group Nick targeting Sheer now. I shall go for the one with no damage. Yes, we hit Grump. I think we hit Grump. Yes, Grump. Grump-tastic. What happened, young man? I don't know. I don't know what hit me. You mess with my World War II super fleet. Things like that will happen. That's a five inch on the face. Five inch on the face. Socked. Right, I've got four point one battleships left. So I've got four point one battleships left, and I'm gonna destroy your evil, evil hordes. Don't add any lead. Don't add any lead. I have eighteen hundred pounds of fuel and I'm not even there yet. Ah. Doesn't look like your RTB. Ha 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 ha. Russians don't RTB. We get captured. Miss. I don't think he added enough lead. Uh, looks like it's gonna hit. No! Go up to the side! It's a... I think that's a port oh, miss. Squirt. Yes! One pixel of health, damp. One pixel of health. Now that's a damn problem. Copy, turning around again. Right, AI, a whole bunch of AIs are going in now. Let's see how they do. They're pretty stupid, even set to max skill level. They're pretty stupid. Don't miss, Dan, whatever you do. I better not. And here goes the AAA, baby. Bombs away. Come on, baby. Come on, spoof wide, spoof wide, spoof wide. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, no, damn! Why? That beautiful ship. Roma dead, Roma dead. Dang it. Four battleships left. Okay, AI is going in on my last Iowa class. You sailed well, Roma. You did well. She's going down. Salute. Another 2,000 men dead. God dang it. May not have Holy been. crap, I landed that. What a simple whimper. Great bombing by friggin' AI there. Sarcasm, by the way. Is he gonna wave off? Is he gonna wave off? Oh, that was close, comrade. He will hit you right in the... in the prison pocket. Right in the nuts. Four battleships, boys. Four battleships to go. Oh, AI going for the Yamato. Don't miss Scotty or too hearty, whatever happens. That would break my freaking heart. Sarcasm, oh, by the way. Oh, don't jinx me. Sarcasm, if you didn't take the sarcasm in that setting. Miss, 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 miss. No, miss. Oh, something happened. Oh. I'll take it, Scott. I'll take that. I've also... No, it didn't take its hits. Admiral Shear is not taking its hits. Oh. Well, I thought I got rid of all the bugs, but... What do you want me to do? Uh, uh, my rockets uh, definitely hit them, but uh, went straight through. Ah, that would be why then. Uh, okay, well, we won't count him then. Go for the others. Right. Oh, Battleship Yamato! It has literally 0 0.0000 pixels left. Suck it down, baby. Guys, don't go for the two rightmost ships. I think they're not taking their hits. It's be broken. Bring out the tugboats. AI is still going for sheer anyway. Yeah, I don't think it's going to register. Let's just double check. No, there's no EDM. EDM hasn't worked. That's annoying. Oh. That is an invincible ship, sir. The annoying thing about it is... Ah, uh, oh, well, it's done, isn't it? What can I do? Uh, right. Is there anyone left to come and finish off Wisconsin and Scharnhorst? They are taking their hits. We can't take off anymore. Socks yeah. on Yeah. Put some bombs out on uh, whatever this one is, but I don't think he's taking his hits either. You won't be, don't, if you do land, sock, don't despawn. You'll just have to refrag. Otherwise, it won't let you jump back in. Copy. Okay, um, that is an AI going for, no, he's not. He's just flying around like a douche. 
<laughs> Man, AI is stupid. Okay, AI is going for a shot at the rear end here. Or not. I don't know what he's doing, actually. No, I agree with that. On routine training mission. Drop the mission and see, come back. Yeah, huh? see, mission success. Mm -hmm. AI started moving again. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, baby. Up you go, uh, Simba Wimba. That guy's gonna roll right off. Not to him, problem, boys. Ooh, so many shots blown by. Rockets out. Okay. Yep. Ooh, it let me in. Yamato's yeah, gonna take a last hit. Ooh, Yamato yeah, down. She dead, boy, she dead. Okay, that one's got working damage model. It should work. away. Oh, they've got the plane. They hit the plane. Oh, but two big bombs. That's two Mark A3s. Boom! Oh, right in the director tower. Sock's coming in for a landing. Oh, just Sock. Uh, deck is congested. You're congested. Let's have a look, shall we? Oh, that does look a bit... That does look yeah, problematic, I'm, doesn't it, I'm guys? I'm on the deck. Right through that other catapult. Resume operations, comrades. Can we tell this guy on the freaking ramp to eject? Or somebody shoot him? Oh, somebody's making a move. Ah, guys, one of the damn module. Uh, Blue started taking its hits. I don't know why, but Blue started taking its oh, hits yeah. now. God, this is such a difficult science trying to get DCS to work. At least that front ramp's down. Oh! Stock's good! That was a great landing. Well done, socking turn. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> that is how you do it. Okay, sit rep valued viewers. Um, we are... The battleships are now 30 miles away from the picket line. The picket line is steaming in. Uh, Wisconsin's taking hits. Sean Horse is taking hits. Blux is taking hits. Admiral Shear doesn't appear to be taking hits yet, but I wouldn't be surprised if that changes at some point. And some of the boys that have survived are trying to take off again. AI are pretty much finished, so it's, I guess, up to you guys now. Rockets seem to be most effective from what I've seen, guys. Some of them just aren't taking their bomb hits, and I don't know why. Okay, we've got Simba Airborne. That's, that's a start. Yeah, the AI have basically got confused and they don't know what they're doing, so they're just flying around in circles. Oh, and this guy's missing a tail. I don't need tail to fight. Tail needs nah, this, me. This is this is where we have two tail. Exactly right. You lose one, you get the other. Russian God saw fit to bless me with two tail. Welcome back, valued viewers. The AI have just basically given up. I got confused. Don't know what to do anymore. So they're just going home. So we're done with AI. Uh, half have been shot down. The other half have RTB'd. Landed on the carrier and basically just clogged everything up because AI. Uh, Simba and Damp are still alive. Simba is uh, 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 16 miles out. In he goes. And Damp is just taken off. Which one are you going for, Simba Wimba? The single boat that is Good choice. by itself. Good choice. I'm going to come in a little more from over top, try and give the flat cannons a little more trouble. Okay, rolling in. Warhead missiles out. Oh, and they got him. They got him. Simba's down. Man, those five inches are powerful. Four inches. How much damage did you do? You got him in red. This really is going down to the wire. The only legit player they've got left is Sock against a red battleship, a yellow battleship, a green battleship, and what we think might be an invincible battleship. We haven't figured it out yet. Which one should I go for? I go for your far left. That's one that's in red. But just don't get shot Copy. down. That's an order. I don't know how you go about doing that, but... In goes Sockington. On the Wisconsin. Good luck. Long bomb. Good 
it didn't look good. Firing. Hit. Miss. Oh, got it. Ah, right. Yeah, but you blew your entire load on it. He's got bombs, isn't he? Nope, he dropped them. Ready, Dam? Looks like you're face planting into someone. Right, okay. So that leaves Sean Horse, yellow health, Blusher, three quarters health, and Admiral Shear, possibly invincible, and almost in gunnery range of your picket line, which is 20 miles. This is getting quite exciting now. Right, Sockington, you've got a. I don't know. Is it, do you reckon you've got time to go and land again? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I've got time. All right, better go and do that. Put that son of a bee down, Dam. That's an hors d'oeuvre. You're our last hope, Luke. The question now is when do the battleships start fighting? I'm secretly glad it went down to guns, 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 guys. Sean Horse is still alive. Sean Horse made it. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, tally on the Am I the only one that attacked it? I think so. She took a few rockets and midships from you. No gun elevation yet, so... Nothing going to be happening for a while. I've been practicing these landings for so long. Yes, Sockington. Well done. Get yourself rearmed and get yourself up there. Get that sexy oh. butt back up there. So, uh, one AI has, has managed to get working and he's on the way to the target really slowly. Really slowly, but he is on his way to the target. No idea how that happened. It just did. Also, Sockington, Walkington, armed up and pretty much ready to go. Good luck, Sock. Go, Sock. To space. Oh! Get another one. I'm not going to shout the W word. Again? I won't do it. I won't Again? do it. You, you said go through. Well, I thought it would go through, damn. I didn't realise it would crash into it. So go get another one. God, this guy... I, mean, I, thought, I, I thought my plane would go through flag. <laughs> With damp and the worst AI flight ever. We're never going to do this. Look, it's attacking at 100 knots. Why do they do this stuff? Hey... If you're slow enough, they won't see you coming. There you go. That's how Simba lives his life. Oh, sweet. He's also attacking the one that's invincible. This is just excellent news. If you're slow and you know what, clap your hands. Weesh, weesh. Oh, he took a baseball. Oh. Yep, that was going to happen. That's what happens if you attack a battle group at 200 knots, mate. Ah, uh, must be my brother. Friggin' idiot. Well, your brother's a bloody... Oh, I can't say. Immediate demonetization. Mm. Now he go faster, though. Now he does go faster! Look at that! It's the bomb load that was slowing him down, Grump. We wish you the best, whoever you are. Baby Grumpnik. God, this is painful, guys. Russian be stupid. You come, you come back home and get middle. Go on, Sock. Go on, Sock. Go on, Sock. The ramp's gone down. The ramp's gone down. Sock, the ramp's gone down. Don't fall out of the sky. Please don't fall out of the sky! Full power! Yes! We're very proud of you, Sock. Uh, Sock number one export. Ah, oh, right. <laughs> Do you really want to export this? Not really. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Not really at all. Right, we are slowly getting there. We do have a sock alive. Also, the fronts are now all 12 miles apart. There may be some gunnery going on soon. Not, mm, not yet. Maybe soon. Let me guess, something weird goes wrong and they don't fire at each other. Ah! Ah, oh, suicidal AI guys going back in. What is the matter with your brother, Grum? What is the matter with him? He's the you worst AI I've ever seen. We did live just north of Chernobyl, so... Uh... <laughs> I've dropped all my stores. Now's the best time to attack. Ah! Hurts my face. We did the uh, visit Pirpiat a couple of times. After they told us not to. Mm -hmm. He has horrible radiation burns. But he's still a pilot. Ah, they have to put that mask on so you don't have to see. Oh, so that's why he, his face is all messed up. Yeah. Which one should I attack? Uh, I would suggest your left. It's the Shan horse and it's the most damaged. That is all. Uh, good news is you don't have to fly very far nowadays. Only 20 miles. Boom, boom, boom. You're not shooting your brother. Aha! Okay, a thing's happening. They've got their main armament of 14 inches or whatever is on the Shan horse. It's now aiming. 
at the... I keep saying Americans, but they're not Americans. They are... Oh! Things are happening. Or are they? No, nothing's happening. Scratch that. Something is happening. My screen keeps going funny, which means something's happening, but I don't know what. I don't know what's They're happening. firing. Who's firing? The Shanhorse. Yeah. The uh, ground's out. They are very silent shots. But they are very the silent shots, aren't they? Let me have a look at the uh, uh, Russians. Uh, the yes! The Slava. Oh, right. It's going on. Right. I understand now. Okay. Slava Cruiser is using a 130 mil. Oh, look at that. Douche, 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 douche. And she's got 14 inches raining down on her too. Here we go. Now, what's going to win? Kind of really well radar guided AK-130 uh, twin barrels. Or old school. Also slightly radar oh. guided. The Admiral Shear is firing the main gun. Are we? Ooh. Grump's brother's still here. Why are you here? You've got nothing to add to this fight. Yes, main armaments firing on the... Uh, on all of them. Yes, all of the main armaments are firing. This is what we're here to see, Valued viewers, at the end of the day. Big 14-inch guns smashing into... Yes, and Peter the Great's taking hits. Here we go, guys. Here we yep. go. Muscles firing. Oh, massive hits on uh, Sharnhorst. So those AK-130s may not be that accurate as you can see, but dang, they can fire a lot of rounds. And one of them is going to hit it. Lining up shot. Here go, and here comes Sockington. This just got exciting. Sock put a blumpkin right in their chest. Whatever that means. Leave a, squeeze out a Cleveland steamer right on his face. Damn, right on his chin. Cleveland steamer, please. Yeah, pretty much the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out for that rusty trombone in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here he goes. Sockington Express. Everyone hop on the Sockington Express if you want a free ride. Let's yeah. cheat. He spins you around real quick. Yep. It will, it will turn you around real quick. Good hit, Sockington. I don't know who has support anymore. I don't know. Oh! What happened there, boys? Oh, oh it's close. still alive. It's got a pixel of health stamp. And Grump's brother's Grump. still doing his thing. Igbin Grump's brother. Nah, he, we call him Ivan. He's the clever one. Well done, Ivan. <laughs> ah, this be good fun. Look at us having fun with a game that's not meant for fun. This is excellent news, guys. It's not a Ooh. game. Exactly. Peter exactly the Great right. took one. Peter the Great. Suck my face, Peter the Great. Okay, lining up. There goes the big sock on uh, Sean Horst. Come on, shoot damn down, shoot damn down. Missiles out. Hit and probably sunk. You sunk her, Damp. You sunk my battleship. Right. It is Blucher and possibly Invincible Shear versus uh, Peter the... Oh, look at that. They're hitting Slava. Uh, two Slava... Oh, picket line, basically. A 90s picket line. Now, this is interesting. Now, the interesting thing about Peter the Great is her guns are on the bloody back. So, well, that's a her problem, basically. Let's have a look at these Slavas. Oh, Slavas are out of ammo. Slavas are out of ammo. They've used their rockets. Uh, sorry, their missiles were 16 of them. And they're out of AK-130 ammo. So it's now going to be a slugfest between these two, right? They're still shooting at the Schoenhorst. Oh, good lord. The bloody Blucher's got no guns on the front. Her guns have been blown up. So, uh, left or right one from the front? Honestly, I'm confused about what it won. Uh, I'm Go left. What he said. Left. What that man said. Things is getting a little bit confusing or something. Yeah, the pickets are about to merge. Yes, they are. They really are about to merge. Oh, The one on your right is the one that we think might be invincible. Damn. It's turned into a really weird fight, guys. A really weird fight. I am true Soviet hero. Yes, you are. I feel Soviet like you hero. should commit to the cannon. Commit Sudoku. Yes, I think you should commit at this point. We're all bored of RTBs at this point. Time to FaceTime your family. Nah. <laughs> Here he goes. Have you got bombs, Sock? Yes, he has. You got bombs, by the way. Is he going to add the correct lead? Who knows? 
Who knows with Stockington, he's like a jack in a box. You never know what you're gonna get. Genius or absolute ridiculousness. Peter the Great's firing, finally. Bombs away. So is he gonna hit? Is he gonna hit? Is he gonna hit? Missed on my screen, didn't hit on your screen? Yet. Yep, oh, I got misses. Poor old talking to him. Time to it? use face. They got 20% damage. Oh, how about that? Five miles away from each other, Sockington, Walkington. Give her the gun. Give her the gun. Ivan, my brother, you make me proud. Oh, you've got a bomb. You've got a bomb, Sock. Yep, I got two bombs. Oh, yeah, right. In goes Sockington again. Scotty to Hottie's cousin AI has still got a full armament out here just circling in the middle yeah, of the Yeah, that's ocean. annoying. That's a W problem, I'm afraid. Come on, Sock. Get it online. Get it online. Inline, whatever. Words. And hey, my cousin's smart. He's staying outside the flock. Yeah. Bombs away. Just gonna drop his bombs and go in the sea and go home. Sock, you better hit! You better hit! God damn it, Sock! Still 20% though. Ah, dang it. Well, yes. cannon and face. Cannon and face time. We brought you in to literally do one thing, damn. Well, don't sound too disappointed, uh, comrade. You now get oh. to die for your country. Mm -hmm. Peter's taking him. I said I'm sorry, Mom. Peter is just <laughs> steadily taking him to the face. <laughs> oh, Peter. Look, Peter is getting hit. Hey, Peter, how does it feel? Hey, Peter. Oh, what's going on? What's going Looks on? Looks like there? they're smacking a Russian Peter. Dude, yeah, with Peter on well done, Sockington. Body. Very proud of playing you. With, playing with a Peter on live Twitch isn't that cool, man. That's right. Uh, I did about 10% damage there, Sockington, but he is not going down. Right, that's all of our AI gone, apart from uh, Damp's cousin. No, whose cousin? Uh, Grump's brother, uh, Hottie's cousin, who refuses to fight. I'm not going to fight. Oh, is he? Has he used all his stuff? Or is he? he no, there he is. He's got full stuff, look. I won't fight. He'll uh, be executed when he lands. One invincible shear, but Blusha can still technically take it, so let's see if this passes the picket line. After that, I'm pretty much going to give up. You know what? And don't forget to assign targets, too. They're useful, though, right? 130 ammo up miles away, because it's stupid. This is a pretty ship. It takes explosions and no scratches on the paint. Yeah, that's very good. It's good paint, though. Good paint. Good solid Russian paint. U.S. should uh, take note. You know, every time they do one of those uh, bomb tests in the water, you know, they have to repair the ship for months. Mm -hmm. uh, it's, uh, the, the paint's so good because it's made of lead. Yep. It's just pure lead. Wow, Moscow's really taking hits, guys. Well, we got to see some battleship action at the end. It's not quite how we wanted it, but it's battleship action. You can't tell me it's not. There it is, AK-630 going out. Oh yeah, Peter got the ba bad gun finally going. But it is on fire. Oh yeah, the gun's finally got... Is she firing? Yes, she is. No, she's given up. Well, that's a her problem, I'm afraid. AK-630, that's a 30 mil high explosive yeah. round going out. Uh, Will Smith's out and is about to give that bitch slap. Zap! Peter is done. Current affairs. Peter is done? How about that? Russian. See where this is going. See where this Oh, the Russians are just getting absolutely mauled. Right yeah, now. getting range of World War II at this range. You ain't got a chance. Massively thick armor, massively powerful guns. Moscow's, Where are you shooting? Moscow's hit. Moscow's yeah. down. Your mother was tugboat. Wow. Do not mess with World War II, guys. Not a point blank. That is what happens to you, boys. You get sunk, is the answer. Right. I think that might be the end of the simulation, Ooh. guys. That's the end. Got holes on the side of it.
Oh, I'm gonna smell squish. Rip the shreds. Yeah. Where was the lead paint on this one? Lead paint sunk. Uh, they, I they ran, they ran out. Off, yeah, I licked off the chips. And that explains a lot. Oh, big 14 inch shells smacking him in the face. And even the noise Rashimi's getting hit, the little frigate's taking hits. I'm a tiny frigate, don't target me, please. Peter the Great's gone down. Ow. My face. What's for going down? What's for going down? Oh, direct hit. Oh, look, uh, Z and Y turrets are working on the uh, on the blown up one now as well. Look at that. One place you don't want to be behind that. Someone a bitch. He's dead. He's dead, baby. He's dead. Zed's dead. Right. I feel we've reached the end of the simulation of anything we're going to get useful, guys. So let's summarize. Well, we did it all fairly. No one got any extra lives or anything, you know, weird. We did it how we needed to do it, as best we could, with the weapons that we have from a 90s carrier group. And they launched all their missiles, killed about half of the battleships. Then the picket line went out and smashed their face into them, like a picket line's supposed to do. And they just didn't have the firepower to take down the World War II. Also, to be fair, a lot of their ammunition was wasted against him, who was just invincible, which is annoying, but that's the way it goes sometimes. Then they did all the airstrikes, but they just didn't kill enough stuff. Um, however, obviously at this point, the carrier would just turn around and run away. So you'd never actually catch that carrier up. It would just run away back to uh, port and, and get some more defences and more aeroplanes, I guess, would take off and attack. So technically a victory from the 1990s carrier group. But it was nice to see the World War II assets in there and blowing some stuff up. Any other summaries from you guys? And they just sunk the frigate. And the only thing left now is the Knets off. So, Roger. Yep. Yeah. It's to me it's hardly it's it's hardly a decisive victory for the battleships. No, it's, it's hardly that because of that one ship that is invincible. I don't know how much ammo it soaked up. Yeah, a lot. It's annoying, isn't it? Yeah, it shut me down. Yeah, it's annoying. It's annoying. Never mind, guys. It was a good bit of fun anyway. Bye bye. The main Grim Reapers videos are now being split between this YouTube channel and the Grim Reapers 2 YouTube channel. So if you want to see all of the Grim Reapers videos, please consider subscribing to both channels. And thank you for watching.